Welcome. Welcome to every day there is something new in our life. No matter what is, you know, the darkness, pessimist, no cancer, no answer. I met a woman today, her only child, 24 years old, and the doctors, they told her, you know, unless we do the operation, he will die within a few months. He is so healthy and doesn't look sick. And I said, do you believe your body or the other? He said, I believe my body. I said, okay. Stop eating all the junk food. Stop drinking. Stop taking drugs. Stop taking alcohols. And just see you are here for something beyond the body. You are needed. Existence needs you. Tether the camel and trust God. But do something. Don't trust God like this. This is not trust. Don't work without trusting. That's not good too. Just combine them together. Trust existence. Trust God. And do your best. Then if God doesn't want us to have the camel, it's okay. But we did what we are here for. If God wants me to be hungry or to be thirsty or to be poor, but I work. If it doesn't come, it doesn't come. Do what you love, money will follow. If money doesn't follow and you are doing your love, you are happy. Then existence, God doesn't want me to have money. Without money, Adam and Eve, they were much better. When the money came, killed each other. Because we have all what we need, the air, the bread, the food. Just be a farmer of the outer seed and the inner seed. This is what is Buddha or Zorba, the Buddha, both of them. Be in the existence and beyond. Be here, be ordinary, and this is the extraordinary. So the Americans now, the Western mind, so much science, created all this technology, but they are not happy. The richer they are, and in the East, so much spirituality and poverty. No. Have them both, but be in the middle. Enjoy the most expensive or exclusive car or horse, but you are the rider and the driver. If it comes, it's okay. If it's not, you are happy anyway. Enjoy your morning walk. So we are here to add more peace on the planet, more joy. This is why we are here. We are needed, we are wanted. That's why we have the choice. What is your choice? Nobody can force you. Nobody can obey me, be loyal to me. No. What's your choice? So enjoy it and do it. It's not going to school or university or have degrees. This is a greed. If you have a book, just read it. And the best book is the existence. This is the universe. So don't be passive. Don't be like the Western people or the Eastern people. Just take them both. The West, they forgot completely the spirituality and the East, completely the science. What are they doing, both of them? More wars, more poverty, more killing each other. Where is the joy? Where is the balance? Just in the middle. Yes, that's it. Trust in Allah, but tether your camel first. This saying comes from that story of a Sufi story. When a master with his disciple, so tired, they went to the inn, the hotel, and they slept. And in the morning, the master asked the disciple, where is the camel? I was so tired. I didn't tether the camel, and God will do it. 
you tether the camel and trust God. Don't trust God and don't tether. No, trust God, but do your work too. And if the camel ran away, it means that God wants us to go walking. But you have to do your job. Do your job and let go and let God. But take the step. This is what the Halaj did. He said, let's walk, let's go for our pilgrim. Let's do the work. If the money comes, if the food comes, whatever comes, welcome. If it doesn't come, it means God doesn't want it. We are doing our duty. Follow the law of love, not the rule of the mind or the head. The religious person is one who goes on doing whatsoever is humanly possible, but creates no tension because of it. Because we are very, very tiny, small atom in this universe. Things are very complicated. Nothing depends only on my action. There are thousands of crisscrossing energies. The total of the energies will decide the outcome, not me or you. How I can decide the outcome? But if I don't do anything, then things may never be the same. I have to do, and yet I have to learn not to expect then doing is a kind of prayer with no desire that the result should be such and such. Then there is no frustration. Trust will help you to remain unfrustrated and tethering the camel will help you to remain alive, intensely alive. And the camel is not a fixed entity. It's not the name of a certain entity. It will depend on the context. It's not the camel. Oh, I want to have money. I work hard to work. Just do the work. Every work is meditation, is worship, not worship. So do what you love. This is what I love. To share my joy, to share my beloved with everyone. The more we share, the more we care, the more we give, the more we receive. Love doesn't grow all by itself with me. This is why we have to share it. And it's currency. It goes all over the planet and beyond dimensions. It's running like the river running to the ocean. And we are the drop, we are the wave, and we are the ocean. So it starts from this mystery called the body. No matter what you put here, it becomes blood, it becomes bone and meat. And so no machine can do what here you are doing. So God gave us the best home, the best mystery. It's a sacred secret. Be grateful and thank you for walking and talking and listening and writing and enjoying what we are writing and and it's so beautiful tomorrow i will read to you this is it comes from osho calendar once a year every year the art of listening he puts all kinds of pictures and we read tomorrow and then you write what you want every day so i write seeds in arabic and in english and then I give it to a friend when it's finished. And then I say, goodbye for this year, and the next year is coming. And every day is a new year. Every day is a new Christmas. Every day is a birthday. The last word, be a light unto yourself. Do not follow others. Do not follow yourself. Be a fellow traveler not a follower, with love and gratitude for everyone. By following others, you can cultivate a beautiful character, but you cannot have a beautiful consciousness. And unless you have a beautiful consciousness, you can never be free. Just to be a follower for somebody, 
a politician, a priest, an imam, or whatever. Institutions. Constitution. I don't want to follow any law. Love is beyond and above. With love, you are good. With the law, do good. I don't want to do good. I want to be good, like the sun and the moon. And they shine on all of us. They say, oh, this is beautiful. I give to this one. I don't give to this. We are all equal. So let's have an empty book like this, a calendar, where every day we can write a seed in it. And then we say, okay, somebody will come and we share our seed. I know two beautiful soulmates. They are 96, these two women. And they share the same Christmas card every year. They have three Christmas cards, 75 years. So they don't buy it, it's like for the same. They can send it back. Thank you, this year. Thank you, I love you. Yes, no, one word and the date. And this card is like 25 years old, 25 years old, 25 years old. So 75 years of friends together, they were in the same university. And then after the university, they said, this is my real university of love. Okay, let's buy one card and one card, and let's, until it's full. After 25 years, the other one, the other one. And this is a thought. A thought is a destiny. And when I asked her, how long is it going to be your pilgrimage? Peace pilgrimage we are, peace pilgrims. There is no date, there is no age, we are out of the cage. We are just flying and we depend on our wings, not on the trees or the branches. They know that there is no death, there is no birth, there is no sin, there is no guilt, there is no devil. They love the devil, you know, it's like part of the divinity and when you are not serious with the devil, the devil will leave you. He knows, okay, let me go somewhere else, that energy called devil, D-E, V-I-L, write it like this, L-I-V-E, E-V-E-I, evil light. Because it's all the creativity of this godliness, this compassion, this beauty. So why be scared that there is a devil, there is a sin? Because you are all judged condemnation. Oh, you are bad, you are a prostitute, you are a thief. We are lost, you know. We, then we come back home. When we are lost in the forest, we come back, we tell so many stories because we met so many new trees and so many new stories and news. 